Guys, Ogs here from the US. Thank you so much for watching. The Premier League winter break is finally here and the Blues are traveling all over the world for vacation with their families. It's really much needed break from football. This is the only chance they have to spend time with family and forget a little bit about football and think about life. They are human beings like you and me. The good news is in this channel, we don't take any break. We walk 24 seven every day. So stay tuned because I'll be posting a lot of videos every single day. And it's also a chance for us maybe to start talking about other clubs or talking about something in, um, in details instead of focusing our attention on Chelsea we can compare Chelsea with uh, what is happening in other clubs. Anyways, if you like my videos, my hard work, please don't forget to subscribe, like the video, comment down below, share and do the rest. This is the very first time we have a winter break in the Premier League. Other leagues have winter break during the christmas period until the new year day and even a little bit more but in the premier league they have to entertain us during you know the christmas time so many people been asking for this break for a long time but many people also don't like uh, to break the tradition so my question today is would you like to see the break continue or you think those players are getting a lot of money and they don't need any rest they need to play and entertain us all the time for me my position is that they are human beings like you and me and they need some rest and also another question is when is the right time to take that break in december during the the Christmas period just like other leagues or January or maybe February that is a tough one for me I would like to keep the Christmas period untouched you don't touch that period we need people to entertain us okay and um, early January it's also good it's okay with me or uh, February if the league decides to go in February for some reason, I'm not gonna fight them about it. All I want is some break for the players so they can come back stronger and continue the second half of the season. <clears throat> because we've been uh, asking ourselves why the Premier League is supposedly the best league in the world and we don't win the Champions League or Europa League often, you know? And you are, if you think a little bit outside the box, you will see that other leagues have a lot of rest, okay? They recharge and they are ready for the second part of the season. But in the Premier League, the player keep on playing and playing and playing like slaves. They don't have any rest. And come February, everybody is tired. Injuries start striking and the Champions League is just like you know you have to be lucky you know t with injuries and everything fatigue to get even in the quarter final so that was one of the reasons so let's see with this break if uh, the clubs from the premier league are going to do better in the champions league for some reason chelsea is still fourth in the premier league and we don't deserve it to be honest with you we are fourth because everybody around us are very poor. But for how long that luck is going to continue with Chelsea? The same thing happened last season with Sarri. Somehow we finished third and won Europa League. But we didn't do anything. We were crap. But it's not going to be every single year. So now we have to start making our own luck which means we have to win games. We didn't sign anybody, but we have to work with what we got at the moment. We have to find a way 
of playing Olivier Giroud sometimes and uh, Marcos Alonso and everybody, even Pedro. We need him. At the moment, just forget about agenda. Forget about how crap they've been. Just everybody need to contribute somehow in this team. We need them. Hopefully, uh, Christian Pulisic will come back stronger. And also Ruben, because he's been out for more than 10 months now. I'm not going to expect too much from Ruben because I made so many videos in the past saying that that injury, only 10% of the very elite athlete can come back to their original fit before the injury. So it's going to be a long, long way to go, but I would prefer to have a 50% Ruben on the field than Ross Barkley, if that makes sense. And that is just my opinion. So for me, this break is a perfect timing for many players to get back to the normal fitness and also Tammy Abraham to be fit 100%. One week they will be with their families and from next week they will be back for the training camp. We don't know where it's going to be. Maybe somewhere in the hot weather. Many clubs travel to maybe Dubai or somewhere else but I don't think Frank Lampard is going to make them fly again. I think they are going to be in London but who knows what can happen. Anyways, guys, let me know what you think about everything that I just said. Think outside the box. Be cool like Engolo Kante and see you in the next one.